Rishi Sunak, 60,399. Liz Truss, 81,326. Therefore, I give notice that Liz Truss is elected as the leader of the Conservative and Unionist Party. Liz Truss is set to become the United Kingdom's next Prime Minister after winning the election to replace Boris Johnson as the Conservative Party leader. It is quite possible that Ms. Truss's response to the cost of living crisis, which she vowed to implement within days of assuming office, will define both her premiership and her prospects of earning a mandate of her own at the subsequent general election. Interestingly, those in the cryptocurrency space are interested in how Britain's new Prime Minister will deal with cryptocurrencies. In 2018, she tweeted that, We need to accept cryptocurrencies in a manner that does not limit their potential and liberate free enterprise by eliminating rules that hinder prosperity. Notably, a recent study revealed that alongside the US and Ukraine, the UK is a leader in overall use of crypto globally. The study factored in the number of crypto owners in a country, the Global Decentralized Finance Adoption Index, the number of businesses that allow crypto payments, the number of Bitcoin ATMs, and the monthly search volume of cryptocurrency terms. Interestingly, in light of the growing crypto sector, a UK parliamentary group has begun an inquiry in August for further regulation of the space. Trust to deal with rising energy crisis. It's also worth mentioning, Trust's campaign for the party leadership has not been free of controversy. When asked how she would address the issue of the rising cost of living, she responded by saying that she would concentrate her efforts on, quote, lowering the tax burden, not giving out handouts, end quote. Apparently, the members of Liz Truss's team are already shifting their focus to the immediate task of declaring what kind of assistance may be on the way to assist consumers with their ever-increasing energy costs. Truss has promised to provide a strategy within a week, with her expected to announce proposals for both lowering home energy costs and strengthening the country's long-term energy supplies. Finbold reported on August 31st that the UK economy is on the verge of stagflation as it phases out Russian energy imports and copes with rising energy and food prices, decreasing household purchasing power and diminishing saving rates with difficult to come by credit. If you found this video interesting or helpful, make sure to hit the subscribe button so you can get more cutting edge crypto news and analysis just like this. Thanks for watching.